Should we do a low trade again? I have not done much uh, trading. Let's try another fight. I didn't really come into this game to play trading, though. This is less less good terrain for us. Zombies look heavily... Zombies much more heavily armored, too. them on I want them walking into deep snow on their attacks so I can use pushbacks to keep guys alive tile being I don't have to I can move up a top notch though still not we're not far enough back we have to be one further back don't we guess if I put a spear wall there that works mine that's fine should have looked at accuracy of our guys too so this is going to be further back because this, this needs to be, okay. What's this guy's accuracy? Something abysmal, 55. I only have two spears, doesn't make any difference. Should have just put a higher accuracy spear guy on the, the north. Alright, go there. Back up. Back up. Guys, going back a square. And I just blocked the square I want to put them on. Nice. Going back, I guess he could go there. Oh, I lose my. Sp That's not appropriate. I lose my. I just put a hole in the wall there if I do that. Alright, zombies. How many of the eaters are there? A lot of cleavers in here. Cleavers are dangerous. They put bleeds. They're not in range. It's quite annoying. I want to move around it all a little bit more. No, I think that's fine. I want the spear at the edge. I 
They're going to get in here a lot. That's okay. We can kill them one at a time as they go in there. Do I need another guy down the bottom here? Maybe. zombie with the hat. I hate him already. A fashionable zombie. It's no good. Something's wrong. There's some trap here we're not totally understanding. Kind of weirdly spaced right now. Where are the rest of them? be doing anything else with you this turn I'd like to shoot that guy and we'll wait it's fine you're good I think the southern bits coming in faster so we'll wait aqua Come down this way to help block. Don't like this little this little shitter. He's gonna go eat this corpse. God, was that a mistake to kill the, the high value zombie like that? Just wait for him to get closer? It kind of feels like it was a mistake. Snipe this guy is a million miles out. There's no way I can snipe him. Just one eater right now. 20 of these, three, four, there's 21, right? It's three is five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. No, I think there's three again. I think it's the exact same. Does he know to go to it? Is he just like, if he's near it, he sometimes does it. Not in range, do what I want there. Well, that could be if Aqua fucking moved. So I can stab this. Wide overhead maximum attack. Swing. Three adjacent tiles in a counterclockwise order. From where? Two tiles in a straight line. For six. So I could go there and hit one of these. That one. Wide swing overhead attack form for maximum reach. What are you talking about? There's no straight line here. Straight line, so I'd hit it. Oh, I attacked this target. I see. So I attack there and it will hit that guy. No. Split. Here. Why can I not use this? It's 
It's a melee attack that hits two guys in a line. So it has to be adjacent to me anyways to trigger it. I see. Alright. Thought maybe it was voice activated. I always check, just in case. I want to shoot that guy. Wait, wait. I want to shoot that guy. I don't think he's available right now. Let's wait. Spear wall in here. Can they even get there? Yeah, I guess they could. Alright, now that we know the zombies have six actions, we're using the, the deep snow to make it so they get less attacks in on us as they move into uh, the train that they struggle with. Not real thrilled about this guy showing up. Let's wait, though. Wait. Should have moved him in. I don't know why I didn't. Can I shoot these things? Okay. about that. Not great. Get that, get that spear, that sword attack though. Does it roll twice or once? Uh, Cleaver needs, Cleaver with a bunch of armor needs to die. Can't hit that one. Try for that. And set up next turn, try to move and shoot for these. I think I have to do damage to those. They what killed us last time. I think we are done. I need to clear out the spear wall if I can. That one will die, die to this guy. This one has no extra damage on him. This one will have two extra attacks on him, so we need to do damage here. Didn't work. You're good. Get to the next turn, right? Damage there. Axe versus unarmed. I guess we care about the axe. This fucker with the uh, double grip cleaver really needs to die. I love his armor, but I don't think I can afford to worry about it. I can only do that once, though. I could have double attacked with slash. I don't know if that was worth it or not. Looked cool. Does that count? here too. No. Okay, that's, I mean, it's kind of good. They're in the positions I've killed them in. Okay, I want to move. Okay. Could move in and shoot that one now, which is fairly tempting. His turn is done. His turn is done too. I'm gonna move down and shoot this one and not get myself locked in. So I'd have to move to there, I guess. That'd be five. We're gonna take all the overflow down this way, though. I don't really want to be in the way of that. Kind of like being central here.
Zombies haven't acted though. They're gonna take this spot and prevent this guy from beating on the corpse. So I'm kind of okay with that. Missed anyways. Uh, is that guy acted? He has stab here. Just don't want to kill that guy before he acts if possible. Uh, we're gonna kill that. I don't know if I can survive. Well, I don't know if I should swing or just take the damage. This guy's on aqua. I'd kind of like that not to happen. Uh, near death. Axe in one turn. So it's whether or not this guy hits. Doesn't seem reasonable. Let's get in there. Move over here. This guy's fleeing now too. I don't want to give him a chance to flee. I just want to swing on him. Because he might flee like he did last time, avoid all the damage, and then come back. Should be a huge problem. 14 turns, 16 turns. I don't know if I can kill that guy. Probably can. I don't know if I can kill them both. So Aqua, Aqua X next turn. Alright. Hit him in the head, where all of his armor is remaining. It's kind of bad news for us. Can't shoot when I'm this close, apparently, so let's bring out the pitchfork. I could just push him back. Let's just kill him. That seems better than pushing him back. Uh, keep spear wall up here. Be done. This guy's really low on uh, the action tree. Let's try to kill this guy. Oh, come on! What did we leave him at? You can jump over. What is this? Adaptation with buff and reset accordingly. Every roll for every... I'm, I'm, put that in one sentence, Garrett. Or one thing so I can get some sense of what you're trying to say all at once. Because, like, reading those disjointed, it doesn't make any sense to me what you just tried to say. And it might be the greatest advice in all time. I don't know. Alright, straight through our chest armor. That's bad news. Right through the spear wall. Okay. Oh, there's a fucking guy you can hit from back there, too. Shit. I remember him being here. Uh, shield wall. Attack there and miss. It's bad news. Okay, pushed him back. That's awesome. He was standing on a zombie and he didn't eat it? Or that's the zombie's head from the other one. Okay. It's kind of good, I guess. Let's reload. He hasn't acted yet. Well, none of them has acted this new round. Okay. Um. Yeah, I guess. Killing it. Okay. Three turns, eight turns, unharmed. Can get after Aqua. Four turns. We might be able to kill that without it. Five turns. We're gonna have to eat that attack. Going to damage here. Why there? Oh, because I'm worried about Automar dying. Push him back. next turn. I'm tempted to move here, next turn to move there, and attack up into a stuff with that. Two-handed sword's been kind of interesting. I'm glad I got a unique two-handed sword, because it makes me motivated to check it out. It's good damage, but not enough to kill it.
Uh, I don't like this morale check stuff going on. yet. I think I'm going to shield wall. And I don't have any way to deal with this guy. Besides hoping resurrects push him out of the way. Are we going to act before that guy, I think? Especially if we just take 20 fatigue loss, we probably will. Okay, let's just end turn there. This guy to get pushed out of the way. It's not gonna happen, huh? Wow. Wow, three resurrects, wow. Okay, they're gonna attack into the shield wall. He's got full health. I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, I do care about these next round. I don't really want to kill them, I just want to put them... well... It's pretty good. It's annoying. Yeah, no, I, I know I don't have to do it, but right now... I can do I can good stuff with keeping these guys locked out. Like setting these up to die and I can wait to the end of the round to kill them with these guys means I don't have to shield wall, means I get to utilize their 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 actions for damage as opposed to defense, and they still can't attack me because I'll wait for them to move up there. Because I wait, they'll move, and then at the end of the round I kill them and I don't have to deal with them next round either. Which I think is good because the weaponed ones are the more dangerous zombies. I just want to know what you're talking about with utilizing quick hands here. I don't think I can, right? Bow shot bow shot is four? No, bow shot's three. So if I could reload, I could. If I wasn't adjacent, I could get them both. Oh, that's a good point. All right, let's wait there. This guy is gonna get attacked twice, three times. Okay. I'd like to kill this guy. Bleeding. It's annoying. Really good if you die. This wavering morale's gotta stop. So we'll wait on this guy. Right through the shield wall, it's too bad. Oh, come on. Good. Takes a lot of stamina to swing that. Okay, so this zombie's gonna kill this guy when he runs. Maybe. There's a chance he doesn't die. Seems unlikely though. Okay, are they all gone? They have this is a lot of cleavers. This guy's really slow. Keep the shield wall for next round. Try to do some damage in there. It's a miss. Alright, now we can kill these. We kill this one first or fail entirely whatever is easier you've already acted you've already acted you have not that was good okay he gets away it's kind of nice this guy got pushed out by the resurrecting zombie that's great this guy didn't eat that's really good Okay. Knife, like him to die. Cleaver, we'd like him to die. Cleaver's not going anywhere anytime soon, though. Let's scoot up. Do some damage there. Hit him in the head. That's a terrible spot to hit him. 
Screwed up, kill that. I think Aqua can double attack now, right? Uh, reload. I hit that zombie. Nope. It's fine though. All right, so I can get two attacks here, I believe. I think. So I think I can go. Stab here. And switch weapons. And get a shot with the bow. No, it's still... No, it's four. I can't do that. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing to make that easier, but... How do you shoot twice with the bow, then? Oh, because it's eight. Two fours are eight, not nine. I don't know what's going on with that. <laughs> I don't know why I'm having so much trouble with that. But I am. Okay. Who is this, Gustav? He's in decent shape, minus the bleed. Zombies already attacked, too. I think we dump on this guy. I need these, we're gonna wait, let them fill in the hole. They both already attacked. I think I might be able to do some damage there. We need this guy to die because he's in the way and he's a nasty one. Alright, we can only attack once, but we can hit that guy, and that's good enough. I don't think we have the stamina to run. Yeah, we do. I want that zombie there, not here. I'd like to be able to attack in there, but I don't think I'm going to have the stamina to swing this more than once. It's 13 fatigue to swing this. No. Okay, we'll go there. Uh, damage here, I suppose. That's the only thing we can do. Uh, yeah, we're in a bit of a bad spot with you. I don't really know which of these we go for. The cleaver, I guess. The spear's gonna hit, though. Don't have enough to do a two attack. So he's gonna go last next round. This guy's running away. Alright, this is Aqua. There's nothing else to do this round. <sighs> do I move forward into this? I get an attack if I move forward. It's probably worth it just for that. Okay. That's what I would kill. Alright, zombie resurrection. This is Aqua. We do have two bow shots if we want it. Bow does more damage than the two handed, so it's probably better. How many ammo do I have left? Three. Two-hander such a problem. I think all the little shitters are dead, though, the eaters. So that's really good. They're the ones that screwed us last attempt. Alright, let's try doing some damage here. Wait. Uh... We need to kill this guy if we possibly can. Also, do we want to be on top of this guy? We could push them away. Let's push him away. It's almost as good as killing him right now. Alright, we can't reload because there's a zombie next to us, so... Let's switch out. Start stabbing. Don't want to be bit here. Or stabbed here. Okay. It's kind of good for us. Went the wrong way. Is a zombie attack jet? Five turns. We might be able to kill it. <sighs> no, we're going to leave it at negative one health again. Awesome.
Okay, it was this. Pull a Joel. Near death, near death. Is this guy attacked? Act him in three turns. No. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have shield wall. He might attack. He might have attacked me before. Now he's going to attack that one. Missed our attack too. It's kind of bad. Alright, we can't do the attack I'd like to do, which would be the AoE. So I'll just attack there. Big hit. Not enough. Alright. So this is the end of the round? Yep. Could just wait, try to get enough stamina to shield wall next turn. I'm very worried about this guy, I don't have any real way of killing him. It'd be nice to have that guy dead too though. That way I can actually use the crossbow. Can't switch weapons this turn again though. Uh, we're probably going to end up pushing one of them back again. Might be pushing this guy back, though. So perhaps we just do damage there. Try to kill this guy with focus fire. Next round. Okay, we're done uh, panicking. That's good. Pierced lung. It's a long injury. He's pretty close to dead, though. You know, I'll come down this way. I just don't know what we're going to end up doing with him. And Aqua... Fine where we are. How many resurrects? This is my first game of Battle Brothers? No. No, it's not. Is it worth pulling out that crossbow? Is crossbow loaded? How do I tell if it's loaded or not? It must be reloaded before firing and it's not loaded. Um We just wait there and make that decision later. Okay. Oh man. Did this wrong. I didn't need you to act first. I need the other guy to act first. This is Aqua. Be nice to kill that guy. Axe in three turns, axe in four turns. This guy can still bite him and he has no armor. That seems much more likely to kill me. Oh, he missed. Shit. on here. Spearman moved into there. That's interesting. Guys are lucky. Lucky to be alive. Alright, uh, they all acted. They have. Uh, it would be nice to kill this guy. Maybe we can do that. It's bad news. It's that hit I was worried about. I'm trying to get the pushback to help with. Um... These guys just need to get out of the way so I can attack this guy. Uh, this guy needs to die. Is it worth walking in? This guy's full health. It is worth walking in. Need to do damage there. Really low on uh, stamina resource. Could uh, switch weapons here, reload crossbow next turn. Seems 
better than the dagger. Okay. Uh, we need to help up here. I'm really hoping to kill this guy before I die of old age, because he's been alive a long time, swinging a lot. Shoot this thing? Cannot. Shoot that. <sighs> Near death doesn't die. Great. Okay. Uh, can we kill this? Maybe. Let's try pushing this guy back. Try to keep this guy alive. Seems good. Uh, let's go there and attack. Nice. That was a head hit. That's actually really good for us. Because uh, we have no chest armor left. This guy needs to die. I might lose Aqua if I move there to attack him. Because I'm not guaranteed to kill him. Aqua has a lot more health than this guy though. Oh, come on. No. Uh -oh. This is getting bad all of a sudden. The armor's gone. Just killed the guy. Gunther's shit aim died. Okay. This guy's already acted, right? No, we're not going to kill that guy in time. And we missed. No! Yeah, that's really bad. This miss is taking their toll. out here. Takes 10 damage this round. Is that 9 health? Okay. Good by Aqua. Killed that guy before he acted. Probably prevents another death. Um, Alright. Clean up. Still bleeding. No stamina. Need to actually do damage here. Positioning is really good with the snow. Alright. Only two deaths. Only one death. Because this guy resurrected. Minus 25% experience gain. Minus 25% initiative. Plus 15% resolve. That's interesting. This is a second permanent wound that doesn't affect immediate combat efficiency. I mean, I guess the... Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I like that or not. Alright, a little tiny bit of gold. A couple of rings. Really doesn't feel like all that much value out of this. And our guys are like wiped out forever. Got a, got a little experience, I suppose. Alright, what do we have for promotions? Why is this guy still pissy? God damn. 